About two weeks ago, one person was killed, a number of hearts burnt in Amuru district in clashes. The long-running dispute is between the Achori in Amuru and the Madi in Ajumani of a huge expanse of land in Apa. Now, on Wednesday afternoon, what could be called a revenge attack was launched on Zoka Center in Ajuman district, where several people were injured. The Rongo began simmering in 2012 with the Achori and Madi ethnic groups, each claiming ownership of the strip of the fertile land, estimated to be around 860 square kilometers. Government has made several interventions to resolve the conflict, but tensions remain. Last year, President Yorim Seven visited APA and later sent Prime Minister Dr. Wakana Rugunda, who met leaders from both sides. At the Tarei Sita celebrations in Kitugum on Wednesday, President Seven pledged to return to APA to resolve the conflict. On Tuesday, Speaker of Parliament Rebecca Kadaga promised to set up a select committee to look into the conflict and report back to Parliament. For the circumstances, we shall establish a select committee to go and address that issue. Following the Zoka attack, a German East MP, Mark Angel Duru, blamed the unrest on some individuals he claimed were promoting their personal interests at the expense of peace for all. Not an issue between Amoro and Ajumane. It is just individual interests that vary. One is these political leaders want to make some cheap popularity, some cheap political capital out of this confusion. Dulu condemned any form of lawlessness in APA and called for calm. Some places are lawless, especially this place we're talking about. This upper place is lawless because everybody behaves the way they want. Agago MP Eduardo Tomac Mott says security agencies should be given a chance to fight criminality in the area as government resolves the conflict. When we are in Kidgum on the 6th of this month for Teresita, that he will make another visit to the area. I think those are all welcome uh, steps to try to resolve this matter. I appreciate that the president in his busy schedule is able to find time to try to uh, uh, give a hand in trying to resolve this matter. Mahmoud also asked the local communities to remain peaceful and give the reconciliation committee time to complete its work. Important that we allow the the the, the police to take charge. It is important also that we allow to sit down and resolve this matter in a civil manner than through this uh, arbitrary uh, notion of justice. The Ajuman District Police Commander says they are investigating the recent attacks to establish those behind it and bring them to justice. We are carrying our investigation, is it? And the people who are hurt, we, we took them to a hospital in Ajuman, save their lives too fast. They are still on the treatment. There are three. It is not clear when the long standoff between the two communities will be resolved. Jumakiria, NTV.